I didn't mean to make things so bad for everyone. You're 15. It's your job. I was the same when I was at school. Yeah, of course you were. What do you do? Give sugar lumps to the wrong pony? Tell you what. You don't have a go at me for my upbringing. I don't have a go at you for your age. Because neither of us can do anything about those, right? Yeah, sorry. It's okay. Anyway, what I'm saying is, though I didn't get suspended for beating up a boy, I did get into an awful lot of trouble because of them. I just don't get it. Sex, relationships and all that. Look at the hassle it causes. Hey, you're not wrong there. You get that he's going to be angry with you, right, Robert? Yeah, I thought he already was. You know what I mean. So when he comes home shouting the odds, as he's bound to, just try and accept it and look apologetic. Go all the quicker. Take it from one who knows. I don't think I have much choice anyway. I do understand what it's like to be you. Not completely. Considering everything you've been through. I think you're pretty amazing. So if you ever need to talk. Yeah, thanks. So that's it. Oh, please tell me Liv hasn't done a runner. She's upstairs. Good. That's all I'd need. Her going AWOL. Does it not go so well? Didn't go at all. They wouldn't let me see him. Oh? And the worst part is they wouldn't even tell me why. All they said is there'd been an incident. Well, what kind of incident? I, I, I don't know. I tried to get to see the governor. Nothing. I waited for over an hour. Still nothing. And Aaron seemed so off on the phone yesterday. Well, don't jump to conclusions. It could be anything. Yeah, well, that's what worries me. Something's happened to him and they won't tell me what. 